being produced for Rugby World Cup that's an endorsed branded product for IRB. Um, I started this a couple of years ago. Luckily I found a company in Auckland who believed in me and believed in the product and we worked together from about May 2010 until just very recently um, and managed, as you can see, to get a product that's got a lot of attractions and things to do throughout New Zealand. So without his help I couldn't have done it. Again, I really appreciate all of those um, companies that had faith in me and worked with me to make this product what it is. So lastly, just before I finish up, um, I'd really like to thank the following people. Um, firstly, my husband Lee, who has supported me from day one, I'm going to get a little emotional, and encouraged me the whole way through, although I'm sure at times he thought I was a little insane, which maybe I was. <laughs> um, but his support has been what's kept me going. Um, to Ambrose Blowfield and the team at the marketing company, um, Ambrose has been my marketing um, mentor. Uh, he took me under his wing three years ago when I walked in and said to him, um, this is my concept. Um, back then it was just AAT Kings and pretty much overnight it just grew out into Rugby World Cup. So um, Joe and Ambrose and your team, I just appreciate everything. Um, it's absolutely awesome. Um, who else is there? Steve Brown and the team at Geom. Um, Steve's become, well, so have Joe and Ambrose have become not only my printer and my mentor, but also extremely good friends. Steve um, and I just highly recommend Geom. They're just an amazing company. He's bent over backwards and I ask him things and he does them within a drop of a hat. So um, thank you to Steve and Geom. The guide, as you can see, is a fantastic memento for travellers for a Rugby World Cup. It provides information on the game locations, Rugby World Cup history, match schedules, training bases for teams, bars, cafes, restaurants and attractions as well as um, is covering off the whole of New Zealand. So originally when I started this I wanted 200 pages and I thought 200 pages would be great. I went up to 250 and then we finally finished a print at 352. So um, absolutely amazing. Um, the, when I first took the contract, the agreement was that we would only do game locations. Um, Rugby World Cup were extremely focused on game locations only. Um, and my agreement to taking the contract was that I would cover off the whole of New Zealand. So um, that's what we did and um, that's the result just sitting there. So just a little bit of a sales pitch. Um, you can buy the book tonight for $30. Just pop on up and see the ladies at Benny's over there. Um, alternatively, um, when the, the um, tournament's on and put up to the tournament, you can buy it at selected bookstores, eye sites, petrol stations and supermarkets, as well as online. Um, there's two sites you can buy it online. One is the official Rugby World Cup 2011 travel guide.com and the other is rugby, uh, sorry, rwcshop.com. So rwcshop.com is with all of the regular product that you can buy.